my Kusumato, and I'm here at the Arnold Palmer Classic to let you in on a little secret. That's right. I'm here today to tell you my big secret on what? How to get girls? How to get money? That's a little later, okay? Let's not get carried away. Let's first get ready to get ripped. That's right. Sick, nasty, every girl looking at you. You walk down the street, every girl's like, damn, who's that? Yeah, that kind of look. Now, it's not going to be easy, all right? It's going to be really easy, all right? So here's the thing. I got steps for you. Rules, if you want to be all official and everything. Rules ready for you that all you got to do is just follow. You follow them, you get this. You stop looking like a little fat ass, you and your little girlfriend. Yo, I'm at the movies, I eat munchies, blah, no, fuck that, all right? You're going to end up like me, Mike. Mad Mike Kusumano and my cousin. You'll meet my cousin later, trust me. He's worse than me, all right? He will eat you alive. Now let's get to the rules. Rule number one, diet is the most important thing obviously, which is why I only choose name brand, all right? I'm talking about Doritos, Nabisco, you know, the good stuff, the stuff that really works. None of that organic bullshit that has God knows what in it. Now, let's talk about protein, all right? You want to try and have as little protein as possible, all right? I mean, is there really any science behind that building muscle? Nah, didn't think so. And even as far as milk, muscle milk, all right? Milk? Milk is for babies. Do I look like a baby to you? Didn't think so. All right? So this is just step one. Let's move on to the next step. <sighs> Rule number two. Make as much noise as possible. How else are you going to know how hard I'm working if I'm not making any noise? This isn't a library. This is a gym. Okay? We don't need to be scared to make noise. We need to be like Twisted Sister. Come on, feel the noise, and then the girls can rock the boys. You hear me? All right, now listen. If I'm sitting here being all quiet and everything, all glad and days and cool, you're not going to notice me, will you? No. I got to make as much noise as possible. I got to be like a flamingo in that gym. A flamingo. So listen, just to recap, make the noise. It's completely necessary. You got to get it out of your system. Alright? I'm not into voodoo and stuff like that. My days of that are done. But I know when something that like that is inside of you still, it will haunt you. We're going to take a little break from the action of the rules and have my cousin Jeremy come and take some viewer emails. So get ready, because Jeremy's coming. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? I'm Jeremy Cusimano. I'm going to read some viewer emails. First email comes to us from Jenny Cusimano. Jenny writes, Dear Jeremy, why would you want to lower your standards just to raise ours? I mean, if we're such fat asses, why would you want to help us? Good question, Jenny. It's because you're fat as fuck, and I'm tired of staring at you. Every time I go into Walmart, I see one of you fat asses walking around, grabbing your fat ass groceries, riding around in your rascals, grabbing your trim spa diet pills. Trim spa? Anna Nicole Smith did trim spa. Worked out real fucking well for her, didn't it? Well, just because Kim Kardashian Kard Kardashian sells trim spot pills doesn't mean they work, all right? All her fat goes right to her ass, all right? Doesn't mean it works. It's just displacement. Simple science. But obviously, you need these rules more than you need me talking to you about the rules. So let's get back to the rules because I'm wasting your time about talking about talking about the rules. Rule three, prepare for the gym. How does Mad Mike Kusumano prepare? Easy, being patriotic. That's right, patriotic, by listening to our anthem. Now I know what you're thinking. Oh, the Star Spangled Banner? What? No, dude, this is 2012. You know as well as I do what our anthem is. Hit it. Toast, let's have a toast for the douchebags. Let's have a toast for the assholes. Let's have a toast for the scumbags. Every one of them that I know. Have a toast for the jerk offs Gotta never take work off Baby, I can Rule number four Cardio <laughs> Or more like Cardi no I find other ways to uh Get it in
Rule five, laugh in the face of danger. How do you do that, you ask? Well, when I want to laugh in the face of danger, I look in the mirror and then I laugh because my face is danger and I'm laughing in it. I hope you can appreciate the picture that I'm trying to paint for you in this scenario. Get it? Uh, oh, sorry. I didn't know I had company. Well, that was our video. I hope you learned a thing or two. Or three. Or four. Or even five. Things. Anyways, I digress. You need to remember whenever you're working out, those five rules, if you get them down, you look like this. Not as good, but close. And by close, I mean probably not going to get anywhere near me, but close. All right? Now, a few things before we go. One thing in particular, women. You're going to get big and bulky. Plain and simple. Don't do weights. Don't even do machines. All right? Stairmaster, uh, body squats, maybe. But just stick to the light stuff, ladies. You know, I know, we all know you're going to get big and bulky. All right? Now, I'm going to ask my cousin Jeremy to give a few other pointers. But this is Mike Kusumato signing out. See ya. Just a couple little disclaimers. A couple pieces of information. Wear tighter shirts. It makes you look big as shit. It's just simple math. All right? Any kind of pain or discomfort that you would feel while working out anaerobically or aerobically, stop immediately. All right? This burning sensation within your muscles that you get as you lift weights is not good, all right? It could cause the blood to pump more rapidly throughout your body, your muscles to swell, and fatigue to set in for possibly one to two hours after your session, all right? These are signs that you're working out too hard, all right? You gotta stay safe out there. Well, thanks for watching our videos. We'll be posting more because I know you fat fucks will need it. <sighs> you think people are actually gonna believe this shit? <laughs> Silly. God, I hope so. <laughs> God. Just like women are big boned. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid idiots. When are they going to learn? They'll believe anything. They will. I mean, what next? I'm going to end up on Oprah or something because this video goes big. You know? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> right, I know. <laughs> That's about as laughable as women's sports. <laughs> <laughs> women's sports. <laughs> Whoa, man. Are cheerleading being a sport? <laughs> Totally. <laughs> God. More like practice for my dick. <laughs> <laughs>